Hello and welcome to my vlog. I'm Brian Foster and this is a log called Spiritist Musings where I talk about different things that I read and I want to present to you and kind of just give you little hints of information from books psychographed from different Spiritist mediums. Now in the book in Reverend Zivaon, Outlands of Heaven, there was a small conversation between the Reverend Zivaon and another spirit talking about St. George and and Zivaon said, well, is, is you know, St. George, who's the, a lot of people consider the patron saint of England, was that a real person? And his spirit said, no, I didn't say that that was a real person, but, it, but he is a symbol, and he's been a symbol for quite a long time. And there's, and because um, what interesting, what the, uh, what the high spirit said, and there's, you know, he is still, an important symbol to many people who were in the Crusades. And there are still people on and around the earth who pray to St. George. And therefore he has some power as people pray and, and people uh, consider and in their minds they think about some in, in, you know important object, that object it becomes spiritually also vital, it's infused. And therefore what happens is when I guess there are still people in the Crusades are still around Earth somewhere. Uh, you know, it's been over a thousand years. Uh, think about, you know, please help me, St. George. Those prayers go to that area and there are spirits there who will, who will take those prayers and they will analyze them and hopefully they may answer them. Therefore, ideas, it, it, we, it's something we underestimate here on Earth, our ideas have power. Our prayers are answered. Our prayers are analyzed. Even innocent children's prayers, which they say in the books, are analyzed much more than you will realize. And, you know, they strive mightily hard to help children, of course, because everyone loves children. And our prayers are, of course, analyzed. And what I like to tell people is be careful what, what you pray for, because you may get it. Of course, how you get it may be something that you did not foresee because the spirit world knows what's best for you and what you need to learn. The other thing is prayers that are uh, uh, negative prayers, like asking for revenge or you know something bad to happen to somebody else, those are actually a debit against you. Uh, and of course, those are, are not answered. Those are actually not good. So. But anyway, I just wanted, it thought it'd be interesting to tell you that the spirit world, when people have ideas, right? And it's you know, like people like uh, Mary, the mother of Jesus, has a huge organization who helps many people because there's many people just constantly set their prayers. They ask Mary for help. In the book, Members of a Suicide, Camilo Bronco went to a, uh, a hospital meant for suicides all ran by and controlled by the legion of saint mary so there's many different you know J jesus christ doesn't just have one organization it's like a huge government there is a, a government there is an organization but there's all kind of what i would consider ngos right non-government organizations which they say okay you spawn this and you can you know you can Take care of anyone that prays to you you can help these different areas and come to us and say what you want to do there's there's instances in the book, let's say in, uh, I think, believe in liberation, where a person wanted to make a little outpost down down in the, uh, the, the dark abyss, in what we consider really, you know, below the crust of the earth uh, in purgatory. And of course, they said, fine, go do it, get people to help you. And you, you can start, you know, putting workers and ask for volunteers from your friends and other spirits. And what they did is they created this, this little uh, outpost and what they and now it's hard for spirits to stay down at that level for a long time. So, what they did is they as they brought people up, they would have the people who were students, right, and who became better and more enlightened. They would stay at that post for a while, teach other students, and then they would ascend. So, if you want to learn more about the spirit world, please read my series of three books, Heaven and Below: Spirits in the Spirit Universe and how we are guided by spirits. There's so much information brought out by spirit, spiritist mediums, all the way from Alan Kardec, who was not a medium, but he was a great codifier of spiritism, 
till now. It, spiritism is a, is dynamic, and what the spirits tell us, we're always they're always going to tell us more as we are culturally and scientifically, technologically ready to hear the message they will give us more information they're not going to tell us everything they're not going to tell us how to cure cancer they're not going to tell us how to go faster than the speed of light no they're going to give us enough information to have us grow on our own anyway i want to say god bless <music>